Hi guys, in this video I'm going to show you the difference between a library and an event and a project. It's a bit confusing, right? Let's get into it. I will try and explain it in very simple terms to understand it if you don't understand it. This is the library and the event is here and it goes inside the library. When you create a new event, just like that, okay, you've got another event and in your event, you put in the footage, your footage from your video. In each event, ideally you want to put footage from one video, footage from another video. And if you want to name this, you can name it just like that. You can, whatever you choose, beach, city. So that is your event. What you need to do now, once your event is there inside the library, you need to go to your hard drive, drag in the footage, the MP4 files or whatever files you have. Then your files are there, okay? Like this. You've got your files dragged in, they're just numbers. Then you need to create a project, which is this. And the project is at the top here. So you right click new project and you name the project and you press OK then you will end up with a project so let's just do that we'll open a project for this example I'm going to bring in a photo and you can see it's just a photo um, but it will apply the same as video so you right click new project you can name it like that you just check your settings here that you're happy with the the frame rate resolution of the timeline so you press OK so now you've got your project to work on. The issue is with libraries is if you keep creating, have all different videos inside one library, then you are going to have a massive file and it's harder to find your videos in the future. I find this a best practice. For every video, I have a new library and the footage inside it, just like I do with folders. We've got a new library. So this will create a new library. These are my folders. Each one a different video and each side in each folder I've got the export footage project screenshots and thumbnail so I'll just go to project and I'll, I'll just put in this one test project like that so that will create it in this folder in this place so I know what the video is and I know where the project is in the future so then yeah, automatically you've got the event here which you pull in the footage and then from the footage, you create the project, like I just showed you. What I did when I first started, I would have a, a library because I didn't understand the difference between event, project, and libraries. So what I did, I just, I kept one library and kept opening new events each time for each video. Then I ended up with a dozen or so different events, different videos in one library and the library was massive and then when I came to organize it moving up my hard drive and then I wanted to go back to that video and I'd have to deal with that massive file and open everything up again and it would also slow things down. So I hope that makes it clear a little bit if you don't understand the difference between libraries and events and your projects where you start working on it. Once you've finished your project you just export it to the file you desire. So sure export you check those they're all um, okay and then you go to your finder and you put it you find a folder and i'll go to that one and press x save it and that will export it to there and then your video is inside here all right that's a bit longer than i expected hope you find it useful and got some value from this if you did please subscribe like the video and i'll see you in another video